cooking on live fire to me is just the best flavor, the best heat control, uh, and it's kind of the easiest thing to do uh, once you understand the different types of woods. I've got pecan, which when you start talking about Texas, pecan and oak are definitely king. But as you get in, you know, also mesquite. Mesquite, awesome grilling wood, where oak and uh, pecan, great for smoking. The reason why is they're great burning woods. I mean, mm -hmm. all of these burn hot, but these burn a lot slower. Uh, mesquite burns a lot faster. But then also you got fruit woods, uh, whether it's apple, cherry, you know, any of the fruit trees, you know, they, they're again, great smoking, whether you're doing hot smoke or cold smoke. And then different sizes. Again, I've, I've got some more, you know, the hardwoods here, just, you know, the, the oak, the pecan, uh, hickory. You know, hickory is another huge one. And we've been smoking on hickory since 1941. It's a great wood. Uh, when I barbecue, I mean, I usually like to mix it up. I'll, I'll start with like an oak uh, and I'll go into a pecan and hickory mix and like finish off a hickory because each one of these has a different flavor. Oak is good and round, where pecan and hickory kind of pick up some of these peppery notes. Hickory's got an amazing peppery note. So like if I'm doing my salt and pepper brisket, hickory's just king when it comes to it because it accentuates that black pepper to me. When I do beef short ribs, uh, I love doing pecan. For beef short ribs, one of my favorite. But you know, a good mix, always keep some fruit on. But you know, when you get into grilling, mesquite definitely is your grilling wood. Oak is another good grilling wood but uh, for smoking pecan, oak, uh, and your fruit woods. Mm -hmm.